Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. What visas did Melania Trump hold before becoming a U.S. citizen? Have you ever wondered about the immigration journey of Melania Trump, the former First Lady of the United States? Let's dive into the details of her path to U.S. citizenship. Melania Trump first came to the United States in 1996 on a B-1-B-2 tourist visa. This type of visa allows individuals to visit the U.S., but it does not permit them to seek employment. However, shortly after her arrival, Melania began working as a model, which raised some questions about her compliance with visa regulations. Later, in 1996, Melania obtained an H-1B visa, specifically for fashion models. This visa is for skilled workers and allowed her to work legally in the U.S. The transition from a tourist visa to an H-1B visa was crucial because working on a tourist visa is a violation of U.S. immigration laws. In 2000, Melania began the process of applying for an EB-1 visa, often referred to as the Einstein visa. This visa is reserved for individuals with extraordinary ability and sustained national and international acclaim. She was approved for the EB-1 visa in 2001, one of just five people from Slovenia to receive this coveted visa that year. To qualify for an EB-1 visa, applicants must meet specific criteria, such as winning a major award or fulfilling three of 10 criteria that prove excellence in their field. Although the details of Melania's application are not publicly available, it is known that she had to provide evidence of her achievements in the modeling industry. Melania's EB-1 visa was a significant step towards her goal of becoming a U.S. citizen. After receiving her green card, she was able to apply for citizenship, which she achieved in 2006. This status allowed her to sponsor her parents for green cards and eventual U.S. citizenship. In summary, Melania Trump held a B-1-B-2 tourist visa, an H-1B visa for skilled workers, and an EB-1 visa for individuals with extraordinary ability before becoming a U.S. citizen. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning into our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.